left the campsite um we're not going to go into uh paris today um as i say i'm finding everything a bit of a struggle um so we're just gonna up there. um we're just gonna make our way out um it's not as if i've not been there before so yeah right i just need to work my way or get out of here a little hill there i'm not going up there it's a bit too steep right i'll speak to you all later goodbye now i know why i was sticking to the same so it's more flat oh now you can see that hill Oh, I struggle. Anybody got any oxygen? Oh God. Oh. Oh. That's probably my own fault for taking a shortcut um, rather than heading up to St Dennis I think it is and then picking the uh, saying up there I just thought I'd cut across and well now we're paying for it <coughs> right goodbye oh. um. <laughs> okay it's all very good them letting um bikes cycle down one way streets the wrong way when you got a wide load like me it's a bit of a pain some of them don't allow you any room at all but at least we're going downhill now after that uphill um this route um something uh, well it's along the same again um i keep seeing signs for the avenue Burt as well um can't ever say it's the way i've ever come when i've done it but then i've usually got fed up with following it and gone my own way so yeah well at the moment we possibly have options of going up to Dieppe what's all up to Dieppe and coming home uh, Dieppe New Haven or stick to the original plan and head towards the Havre although another idea I'm thinking of is um, when we get to the Havre I'm um, cycling up to um, Cherbourg along the D-Day beaches I don't know I think we'll see once we reach uh, La Havre uh, of course because you can't get a ferry from La Havre anymore so we'd have to cycle along to Carnoustrum anyway so we shall see how we get on how we feel Goodbye. Oh, there you go. Some more boats coming along the Seine. Um, they don't look as if they're loaded to me. They look quite high in the water. But, um, what do I know? That'll do. Um, touch wood, this route so far is very good because it's been nice and flat. Um, normally, uh, when we've left Paris in the past, we've had quite a few hills by now. Um, I couldn't tell you where I am because I haven't got a clue, but 
um, we're on that route 33 I think it is I said um, saying that I've seen signs for the harb so it's fine bit of a bonjour bit of a long way round I know following the twists and turns of the same but it's quite a windy day so it's quite good in one respect because we're not against the wind all the time and I suppose in the same breath we've not got it behind us either all the time yeah very nice along here right I shall speak to you later goodbye well this could take a bit longer than expected um we just passed the sign and it said 316 miles to La Havre uh, kilometres to La Havre I mean <laughs> definitely a long way round but as I say better than those hills Um, we've come off that uh, villa route, um, uh, the, the sale or whatever. Um, I'm trying to find a hotel. Um, there doesn't seem to be any campsites around. Well, there was uh, one campsite, I don't know, eight, maybe nine miles ago. Um, it didn't work. Well, the gates were shut. It didn't really look as if it was open. So we didn't bother stopping there. I can't see another one on the map. Uh, we just tried a hotel in wherever it is we've just come through. Um, I couldn't get any answer there. So we're gonna stick to the roads a bit in the hope of a hotel will come up rather than make a beeline for one. I'll just as well keep moving in the right direction and just hope one turns up <coughs> uh, Mil Mulen however you pronounce it that's where we tried to find a hotel but it didn't work I need to go over there let's go that way right Right, I shall speak to you all later. Goodbye. Um, well, that was a stroke of luck. Um, shortly after I spoke to you, um, we came across this motel. So, yeah, so that's good. Um, unfortunately, there's no hot water. But that's broken, but <clears throat> it's fine. Some of the campsites don't have hot water, so it's all good. Um, I think it was 41 miles today. Um, I must admit, I have been feeling it. I didn't um, really sleep that well uh, last night. Um, I forgot that uh, campsite in Paris. It's right next to the main road. Uh, yeah, but hey, it's fine. We're finished for the day now. Um, I don't really know what the time is. It is... Well, it's half past three, so it's not too bad. So, as you can see, we got a few few things drying out because it was wet in the night, so everything was a bit damp this morning. So we shall have a cold shower in a minute. And there's a buffalo grill over the road, which oh, the many times I've been to France, I've never actually been in one, or I don't recall ever going in one. So. Yeah, I mean, that's what attracted me to thinking there was a hotel nearby. So we shall go and try that out a bit later. Right, I shall speak to you in the morning. Goodbye. <laughs>